all that knowledge and technology is in the new machines here where they can just run unattended, high quality, and run for a very long time. Welcome back, my friends. I got Frank again, and we are standing in front of the Fuji Space Station. Well, at least that's what it looks like to me. Are you gonna beam me up, Frankie? How does this thing work? I mean, yeah. I know two of the most important aspects to immediately shout out are a B-axis head and the amount of tools that I can fit with this tool changer. I know those are very important, but the whole machine, this looks like a spaceship to me. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's a great looking machine, and I love when something cosmetically looks nice as well. Yeah, thanks, Tony. So this is our Gyroflex Ultimate Multitasking Machine, right? So as you mentioned, it's got a B-axis, uh, 15,000 RPM, 25 horsepower. So a very powerful B-axis. It can machine on the left side, it can machine on the right side. Uh, and then of course a 40 tool change, Capto C6. You know, very interesting design what we have. We bring the, the tool down with the ball screw and then our arm changes here. So it's about 11 seconds from top to bottom and it's about three seconds from chip to Ooh. chip if the tool is loaded at the bottom already pre-staged. So very quick operation, uh, you know, very flexible machine, X, Y, Z axis, um, live tooling capability in each turret, in each station, 15 station turret on both sides, uh, large capacity main spindles, both our main spindles. So, you know, this machine is offering a lot of flexibility to get a lot of work done for complex parts. Frank, I'm gonna tell you another quick story. I'm a storyteller. I had a conversation with a gentleman one time and he told me, bring me a milling part and I'll do it faster on a turning center. And when I see something like this, and I know that the turning center capabilities with live tooling, but then you throw in a B-axis head, now I'm incorporating the best of all the worlds, right? Now I'm saying, yeah, give me anything you want. Get as creative as you want. And then when I think about, I have so many options on my op 10s and op 20s and flipping things around and whatever I need, I have to have the tools. If I have a limited amount of tools and I have to have multiple amounts of work, then I'm almost limiting myself there because some of these components might have 20 or 30 tools all on their own for one side, for one operation. So this to me gives that, that true capability and capacity of what someone might need in order to get a, a productive work done on a single machine instead of five, six, seven, eight machines. Yeah, 100% correct. You know, this is a one and done machine, right? Offering a lot of flexibility, a lot of capability as you mentioned. And you know, again, available as standard with a gantry robot to load the raw material and unload the finished part, right? So you see it just runs and runs and runs. Again, no operator has to really be present here in order for that to be set up, so. How many times do you think when you've spoken to people at trade shows, at, at sales presentations, on video with us, we say the word run? Because that's what you guys are doing all the time. Runs and runs and runs. It's like a marathon runner. I would be tired, but this machine never gets tired. Yeah, you know, it's, it's what we talked about before. You know, we started out over 60 years ago with the first turning machine, and we've innovated, 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 innovated all along with our, you know, core competency of automotive, right? They, got, they have to run 24-7, 365. And so all that knowledge and technology is in the new machines here where they can just run unattended, high quality, and run for a very long time. Yeah, I'm gonna bring this whole thing full circle to where you started this thing off with that B-axis head, and you talked about its torque and rigidity and power, right? And I think about sometimes the limiting strength of a live tooling. What that does also, in my opinion, is it allows you to bring in the super alloys if you need to, those harder materials, those ones that oftentimes either will have a longer cycle time because the live tooling can't, maybe they'll do a pec cycle instead of a full drill or a full bore or whatever it might be. That to me, ultimately reduces cycle times as well. Just to bring this all full circle and talk about that B-axis head, which complements this beautiful spaceship already. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely correct, as you mentioned. Uh, and once again, you know, this machine has a lot of flexibility. It has a lot of capability and can make parts one and done. Completely. I like when we put a lot of abilities in front and behind of the capability, you know what I mean? So this is a great machine as well. Just like all your machines that you have on your turnkey centers and, and, and the willingness to do turnkey work to make sure everyone's taken care of. Guys, if you wanna know more about this machine, the specs are on the website, everything is there. We're not gonna go into details of speeds and feeds. That's what the, I don't wanna bore you with that. I just wanna showcase this amazing technology, but the research is there. What's your website if I wanna learn more about this machine, Frank? Fujimachine.com. It is that easy. It's the company name.com. I love it when the clan comes together. Where's our cigars? Yeah, we need some. Yeah, like the A-Team. Well, we got them in the car, I think. Thank, Thank you. you all for watching. We'll see you again soon.